Well, hi everybody, my name is Adam Curry. I am uh, known as the host of the Big App Show and what I'm here to do for you right now is show you a, an overview and a demonstration of the most excellent app, 3D Gallery. And I say most excellent app because when I featured it on the Big App Show, it, people went nuts about it because this really is a whole new way to view your pictures. Of course, your iPhone is all set up. You know, you've got your photo app there so you could show your pictures to other people and kind of, you know, just slide through them, but when you really want an immersive experience, when you want to kind of wander around your own gallery, which I'm standing in right now, that's where 3D Gallery comes in, and it's really a fun way to organize your photos, your collections, and just look at them whenever you feel like it in a completely immersive environment. So the app is already fired up here. This, by the way, is the new version, which has a really fast graphics rendering engine. So I'm just going to tap on continue here to get going. Now it's loading up. I've already put a couple of pictures in some of the rooms here. But I'm just going to show you some of the basics here. Three taps, by the way, removes the menu, so that's not in the way. Now you basically drag your finger along the, street, along the screen here to uh, navigate. You can look down, you can look up, you can really look all around wherever you want to go. You can already see I've got some picks in here. And if you want to move, that's what these arrows are for. So you can move forward, backward, you can move to the side, yeah, left, right, and you really already see how this, this gallery is just a great immersive environment. So in this particular room what I've, that I've set up, and I'll show you a couple different setups in a minute, I've already pasted some pictures in here. So if we want, we can uh, just move forward a little bit. I want to move, maybe just move back a bit turn to the left here. This is uh, the lovely Miss Mickey. She's there with a couple of friends of hers at a party. I've got my daughter over there. I've got uh, oh, a picture I took of myself with a fat booth. <laughs> That's pretty bad. And the, uh, of course, the picture of me flying. I love flying pictures. So you can just kind of move around. Already you can see that I'm completely immersed here. and I'm just like enjoying my pictures. And of course, you can hand your phone to anybody and they can do the same. So let me show you how you go to a different room. This is kind of cool, where you essentially can walk through different doors and get to a whole new space. So now I'm in another space. You see what I mean? See how cool it is? I think I might have set a couple pictures up here. There's a lot of great default pics in here, so you can kind of get the idea of what to do. Oh yeah, here we go. This is where I set up some old pictures of my MTV days. There's me with uh, Tina Turner. Oops, sorry, Tina. Uh, over on the left here, I've got me with the Beastie Boys and Run DMC. So how do you set up your gallery and what kind of configuration options are there? Well, allow me to demonstrate. So we're going to click on this menu option here. So currently I'm in Gallery 1 and you can set up picture sets. And let's go into editing mode. Actually, it's going to picking mode right here. So I'm done. So now when I double tap on a picture, it's going to bring up a menu. And from here, I'm just going to select, uh, let me see, what do I have? I've got uh, well, just some random pictures, but I'll take one that I shot of me with another fine app that uh, kind of does a pencil drawing. So now I've already replaced that picture of Tina Turner with me in a pencil uh, drawing. Now we can resize this if we want. This is kind of cool. So we'll go to menu, we'll go into the editing menu. Now, as I tap on this, brings up another menu up at the top. Now, right now we can be in move mode. So I can move this right or left as I choose, up or down. If I want to go to resize mode, I can make it bigger. I could even rotate it if I wanted to. Of course, I want to have it in the proper way. And then we're all set. See how that works? It's really simple, right? Now, let me show you some of the other rooms because it's just so astounding how beautiful this app is. So we go to gallery two. Okay, that was the room we were just in. Here we go. Look at this. Look, this is a kind of like an outside gallery and you can even look up and I think somewhere the ceiling is open. But you can have pictures wall high anywhere you want them. It's really, really beautiful. And I think we can even walk through a couple doors here. Let's see what's uh, hiding behind this. It's almost like the fun never stops. Oh, wow. Look at this. Wow, and there's one of these rotating pictures. By the way, you can also jump up and down if you want to. So look at that, look at that. Look at this gallery, man. This is just so beautiful, I love it. So here with one of these rotating pictures, this is great because the pictures that you set up in the gallery will automatically show up in the rotating picture frame and just rotate and go through all of your pictures. It's really quite cool. Look at this, look how beautiful. And I'm just, I didn't, these are default pictures and they're already really cool. 
Look how nice that is. Isn't that just beautiful? Let's take a look at uh, the third gallery. Let's take a look at how that is. So again, we're loading up the gallery here. This is a nice and airy room. There's a skylight. And again, more doors for you to go through. You can also protect these rooms, which is kind of handy if you have a room, say, uh, of some of your private pictures. And the way that works is actually quite simple. Now, of course, it's always cool to look at all of these pictures as they are uh, on the wall, but if you, if you want to go into uh, viewing mode, which uh, there you go, I'm in viewing mode now, when you double tap on a picture, it brings it up full frame so you can really, really enjoy your pictures. So there's so many different features, so many different uh, options, and uh, of course, this app does update from time to time, so I'm sure more rooms will be added. It's also available on your iPad. That experience will completely blow you away. It's called 3D Gallery X in that case. It's available from the App Store. It really, truly is a great way to experience your pictures in a personal, immersive way. 3D Gallery, definitely get this app.